What's up YouTube, Dlex here today, here to talk about the changes to Dream Drop Distance in Kingdom Hearts HD 2.8. It looks like Kingdom Hearts Dream Drop Distance is actually running at 60 frames per second. You probably won't be able to see it here on this video because my editing software like dumps down on the frame rate. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty cool. This is going to be the first Kingdom Hearts game to be running at 60 frames officially, which is pretty badass. I'm not going to lie. So this actually makes me pretty excited to play Dream Drop Distance uh, HD for, you know, seeing how buttery smooth it's gonna be it's gonna be fantastic can't wait to play more of that and we also get a new dream eater in this game as well which is called cat nuki which is like a fusion of a cat and a raccoon it looks like it with a leaf on his head i don't understand that aspect but it looks like meow meow pretty much does the same uh, link attacks as meow 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 i think that's how you, the other dream eater is called so that's cool there's also gonna be other new dream eaters being introduced in this game so i'm wondering if they're gonna be just other iterations of these Dream Eaters we already know, or are they going to be like, or have officially really new designs? I'm looking forward to more of that. And as you can see, the you can see the we can actually see the hub for the first time was pretty cool, and you can see the health parts much, much thicker than the original one. So that's pretty cool. And then we got the command menu, which is looking pretty nice. You can actually see the way to access your links is you just, I guess you press left or right on the D-pad and there you go. You know, you can link up with your dream eaters, which is pretty cool. And then the way to access reality shift is different this time around because you know, the only the way to access reality shift through the 3DS was there's the, the bottom screen. But now since it's just one single screen on the PlayStation 4, you have to press triangle and circle to access reality shift so i think that's pretty cool i'm really liking these new changes they made to dream drop distance i'm looking forward to this game you know it definitely is kingdom hearts dream drop distance is definitely one of my favorite kingdom hearts games in the series so i'm glad that they made these changes and made it compatible for the ps4 making it run at 60 frames per second that's awesome are they going to do that for kingdom hearts 3 i hope so even though it's even though 0.2 is not running at 60 frames, I think it'd be pretty cool if Kingdom Hearts 3 wasn't 60 frames per second. But that's just my personal opinion. You guys may feel differently. Let me know you guys in the comments and down below about Dream Drop Distance being 60 frames per second and the changes they made to this game entirely. Subscribe more content on Kingdom Hearts HD 2.8 and other games in general on Demolex. I'll see you in the future.